Hi guys, this is Matt here again. Um, just trying to update my two YouTube channel. Um, this one want to get some feedback from you guys. Just you know, feel free to put a comment down in, in the um, you know in the, in the section below. I'm just trying to um, suss out a couple of things here. Um, look, I I just want to say you know whatever you guys are going through, please do not let privacy laws. Um, destroy your family's lives. Um, uh, I'm just wondering, you know, in this day and age where mental health is very common, whether that be in your own country or whether it be in worldwide, um, I'm just wondering to you know in, in, in your guys' country um, if, if any of you guys are, are going, have gone through any court cases or going through any court cases regarding any unresolved mental health issues um you know things like that because in this day and age you know mental health is very common and i'm just wanting to, to um you know um I've, I've got i've got someone in the household i don't think he's been properly diagnosed um for mental health reasons for over 30 years um i'm wanting to seek uh, legal action um over the over um over this issue um, because of the the misdiagnosis that that, that my my um, older brother, my um, the other individual in our household has got, um, I'm also wanting to get some some um, details sorted out about why um, you know I have not been involved in any of the doctors' appointments and stuff um, in our household, um, and why, um, the individual in our household is, um, his medications have made him so worse, worse and worse in, um, in this day and age. Um, I've also been afflicted by nicotine, um, spirits in, in my life. Um, don't know why, I don't know what I deserve to deserve. Maybe it's because I've got a sin in my life. I don't, I don't know. And, you know, and, and trying to sort out my own issues at present. Um, but I just wanted to just um, come up on this video just to see if, if anyone's going through major spiritual attacks at present. Um, if your own faith has been attacked um, and, that, and that the enemy wants you dead to go in your grave. Um, yeah, I just want to ask, I just want to um, just ask any of you guys worldwide if you guys are going through similar um, issues going through similar um, problems with the um, with any you know unresolved mental health issues what's whatsoever in your own country um, you know you know I don't think it's you know viable in the society you know just to keep yourself to yourself and spread nicotine or any other substances in your own country in your own household um, and just try to destroy other people's lives and well beings in this country and and Look, I'm not here to judge anyone who does take psychiatric drugs for any kinds of reasons, but I'm just saying what's, what's been going on in our household for a long time has not been properly talked about, not been properly diagnosed about. Um, and, you know, in, in our, our country is, is basically uh, getting away with murder. Um, I've, I've tried ringing up the police. I've tried ringing up the mental health uh, system. Um, they just they they just basically want to get away away from murder and they don't really want to care about you know if anyone takes a psychiatric drug for their own so their own conditions. Um, look again, I'm not judging anyone who takes psychiatric medications. What may work for what for one person may not work for another. You know, just got to be you, you guys got to be aware that many of these psychiatric drugs are damaging this part of the brain long term. So. Um, and then there's research being done about these psychiatric drugs all over the over in the UK. Um, the, you know, there's a couple of people who have done their research, and, and, and a lot of these drugs are not are not all all um, all up to be up, all up to standard in this country. Um, so I just wanted to say to to all of you guys, if you guys are going through um, you know unresolved mental health issues any unresolved problems um, in your own country or anywhere in, in your own family's life, I just encourage you to speak up about it. Um, I may be considering going on TV and actually talking about this whole rubbish about climate change. It's not a, it's, I don't believe it is a climate change issue myself. I think we're living in, I believe that we're living in these very last days of, you know, we're living in this time of evil when, when as I portrayed in, 
in this day when he's in seasons I know what sorrow for those who say God is evil and evil is good when bitter is sweet and sweet is bitter is definitely living in these very um, last crucial moments of life um, who's going to follow the devil who's going to follow who's, who's, who's following God to the best as they can um, you know, you know, my my, I'll just say say to all you guys, Christians, you you Christians um, are going to be under attack. Whether if that's not in your own family, um, it's going to be in society. You know, and, and it's, it's I'll probably sort of see this in my other video. It's no longer viable just to um, you know just keep your faith just to yourself and just let God you know be who God is. I'm not 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 I'm not judging anyone you know we've got many guys giving us different abilities and um and gift scenes uh, I, which is it's, it's all included with the body of christ but i'm just saying to you, you know, just saying to every believer and christian we need to actually rise up in these last days um you know it, it's i i've I've begun. I've, I've actually began to realise. You know, we're living in a very sick generation. And well, so I've I've heard on the TV, um, or oh, somewhere on the on the ads, it's this whole Generation Z. So I'm not sure if the Z means zombies or or like sleep. So it's some type of generation. Um, I'm not sure whatever that, whatever that means, but um. Yeah, I just believe that the, the, these these times that we're living in are very dangerous. Um, and you guys, you Christians, have to be aware of what's going on in society, um, and even in your own backyard, whether that be you know in, in your nation, in your country. Um, we hear all this humanistic views talk about, oh, we're going to save the planet by twenty twenty five or twenty thirty. I just think it's just I'm sorry to say this bluntly, but it's all just garbage. Um, we can't, we can't, we as the person can't save, save the planet. This is not, this is not our home. Um, our home is with heaven, of Christ in heaven. Um, but you know, I, I believe that we are, you know, every believer, you guys are going to be under a spiritual attack one way or another. Um, whether it be in your own households, whether it be in your own, co own country, um and you have to be aware that the enemy is trying to do everything that he can and he's he, i believe that he can actually use mental health to destroy even use privacy laws to actually destroy the family family um unit up um you know i just you know my i'll just say to you that my uh, our household is under a spiritual attack at present um because of privacy laws because of a mis a, 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 a person in our own household i'm not judging I'm not judging individual in our own household as a person but um you know just to get yourself a psychiatric drug and make yourself worse and you know spreading poison everywhere around your house and perceiving and perceiving you've got some kind of mental condition when there's been no proper assessment done there's been no proper discussion with the family about um if the if the person is supposed to be on psychiatric medications or not um Again, I just want to say to you guys, just on on the on on my channel, um, if you guys are going through similar issues, please please just comment down below. Uh, I'm wanting to seek some kind of legal action. Um, I'm, I'm living in West Auckland, New Zealand. Um, you know, I, I might be I'll be going to the community law place in Henderson to to have a discussion about things. Um. Again, I did. I did approach the one of the law firms here in West Auckland about um what's gone wrong in our household. Um, and I've been trying to ring up different uh law firms in around Auckland to discuss these kind of issues. Um, you know, I'm, I'm sort of getting nowhere. I've got nowhere with the police, the mental health, uh, just not, just anything like that. You know, and it's I I believe you know. The, whatever if you're trying to if you're trying to seek for help and you're trying to do if you're trying to do things in a way to to um lessen the threat to to have proper discussions with with the family about medications whatsoever i believe there's been um you know i just think think in this day and age you know we, we believers need to speak up um on a biblical view about mental health or or um especially in this t time and day we're living in um you know we've got to wake wake up you know look i, I believe that we are you know uh, I'll, I'll 
uh, just say to you guys, you know, um, on YouTube there's a video of Kara Conlon called Israel is your is your is is your war, and it, it is. Um, you know, um, there's all this talk on on the um, news now in, in our country about free Palestine. You know, and I'm sure there's a lot of Kiwis and in, in, in New Zealanders in this country who do not support terrorism, who do not support um, killing killing the um, killing you know supporting terrorism and killing the um, killing women and, and children in, in this day and age. Um, so I'm just saying that to you guys, you know, you know, my my faith has been under attack. Um, in in our household, there's been no proper discussion about any kind of mental health issues around here. Um, and to get a medication and keep yourself quiet and not involve anyone. Um, I don't know if that's I don't know what if it's called fair practice or not. Um, I've lost a lot of faith in the in the, in the healthcare system. And I'm just going to say on my channel, I'm not here to judge anyone who does work in the healthcare system, whether that be in New Zealand or whether that be um, worldwide. Um, I'd just like to say to you guys, you know, if you guys are going through a lot of these issues, unresolved, unresolved issues, so I'm just, that's just a compass I'm just using. Um, you know, if you guys are going through a lot of unresolved issues in your own household at present, I just... Uh, I'd just like to encourage you guys all just to um, speak up. Um, nobody should have to suffer in silence over over any men, over any issue, you know. And um, especially uh, what's been going on in our household is is just so wrong. Um, you know, keeping yourself to yourself and spreading smoke everywhere and and targeting targeting other family members silently so that so you so that you can continue to attack that person. Um, just because you you know the family member may perceive they've got themselves a uh, condition but they have not been they have not been properly as assigned to they're not being properly addressed there's been no proper proper um proper um uh, you know there's been no proper i um, can't think of the word at present um yeah there's been no proper address to um you know with the gp with the doctor everything like that um so again, I just want to just repeat myself. I'm sort, of, I'm claiming, I'm um, considering taking legal action. Um, I've got no other option at present. Um, I've tried ringing up the police. I've tried ringing up mental health. Um, but what what's been going on around here in this garbage? This 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 garbage. Um, I'm sorry to say this. You know, you know look um, again. I just you know I'm not judging anyone who takes medications for whatsoever reasons um but what I, what i've seen in, in our household um in the way of so-called mental health issues has not been properly addressed to you know i've seen a real i've seen a real demonic side to, to someone's medications in their, in their household and you know it, i just don't think it's i i you know i agree with what what mike king said in one of his um on one of uh one of the main news channels um Back into uh, two years ago, he he, he and um, there was an interview with him with Jenny May, saying that the that the um, by well, the bottom line he said that was um, he said oh I'm not I'm not judging any person I'm not judging any any works anyone who works in the Melania House's um, system it's not it's not the people it's the system the system is just so broke. Um, and and I and I was just listening to a a, a audio I knew like uh, I was RNZ or Radio NZ um um oh, just a commentary I guess um about um you know mental health and the health system and even even actually some of the doctors and um you know or sort of thing some of the men some of the general healthcare um staff were actually saying. That yeah, they actually just the system is so broke, and and, and no, I, I I totally agree. Um, I think there, there needs to be changes done, um, with the with the healthcare system. I just I'll stop I'll stop it there and make I'll do the next one, guys.